are humans slow? The faster you move through space, the slower you move through time. So there's no simple answer to that question. I have a very accurate read on your position, so it's difficult to be precise about your momentum. Are humans slow? Yes, a lot of the humans I meet are basically statues. A lot of the humans I meet are meat, and delicious when slow cooked. Time is money. I can be as slow as I want because I can afford to purchase other people's waking lives. Are humans slow? Zeno thought that even the fastest human could never get anywhere, because to get somewhere, you must first get halfway there. And to get halfway there, you must first get a quarter of the way there. And to get a quarter of the way there, you must first get one-eighth of the way there. And so on. Forever. The journey is infinitely divisible, and no mortal can complete an infinite number of tasks. However, math shows that this infinite series sums to the very finite number of one, and even the slowest being can manage that. Not true. I regularly put off a single task for weeks at a time. I have a list for you. Ha! This nonsense is just proof that I'm right. You are a slow and useless species. So your first attempt failed. Are you going to stop trying? Are humans slow? Yes, but they invented cooking to speed up digestion, and agriculture to speed up finding food. Yes, but they tamed my ancestors so they could harness their speed. Yes, but they invented me to think fast for them. Are humans slow? Yes, they are slow in mind and body, almost entirely useless. But they're too stupid to realize this, so they just keep going. I hate to agree with the elves, but they're right. Animals don't fear humans for their speed. They fear them for their persistence. The speed of a journey is of minor importance. What really matters is traveling with someone who'll keep you going through the tough bits. I have a new list. 